Hey guys, M13 here. I'm kind of tired. I woke up at 5 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> it's eight, and it's 8 o'clock at night. I should be going to bed soon. But I'm taking the ninja to the car wash. It's actually tomorrow is the beginning of Chinese New Year. And, um, and uh, part of the tradition, Asian tradition, is to, uh, you're supposed to like, you're not supposed to clean during Chinese New Year but you're supposed to clean before it. Like you're supposed to um, clean your whole house and everything before Chinese New Year hits. And then during Chinese New Year, you're not supposed to do any cleaning. You're just supposed to like party and relax. And uh, the week of Chinese New Year, it lasts a whole week. It's not like a day. Uh, kind of like Hanukkah, I guess. Um, the week of Chinese New Year kind of represents your upcoming year. So I guess Asian people want to be lazy and dirty for a year. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, you know, they're just, I don't know, it's supposed to be like, you're just supposed to like party for a week and that's gonna like bring you like happiness. I think it's like happiness. You're supposed to be like just happy and not do any like chores. Come on, fuck. Jeez, you're on a scooter lady. Scooters are supposed to pass cars. They're not supposed to mingle with the shitty cars. All right, turn in front of me. Yeah, you turn too, fucker. See what <laughs> See, I'm tired. On it, honestly, though, on it, I'm joking, but I'm like, and most of that aggression was like, it was, was it false? No, it wasn't really. I'm just, I'm, I'm actually, yeah, I'm grumpy. Um, when I'm tired, like, uh, yeah, if I'm tired, especially in the morning, if I'm tired or if I'm hungry, I, I can get, I can, I can be really road rage prone. Uh, yeah, and I'm like. I'm very tired right now, which is not a... They say that riding tired or driving tired is, is, is you know, it's comparable to, like, driving drunk. They got things about it. Speaking of which, you hear about that fucking retarded, idiotic cop in America? Well, <laughs> did I even need to state that? That he, uh, he'd been... He, he was a motorcycle cop. He'd been... He had been... He'd been on duty for, like, 12 hours straight or something like that. Like, some stupid amount he'd been riding his motorcycle for 12 hours straight on duty and he was like nearing the end of his shift so he was like yeah or he'd, he'd already been on duty for like 12 hours but he and, he and it's that's longer than he's supposed to be like he was like break he was like breaking the rules by being on duty for such a, a long amount of time like they have rules that motorcycle cops are only supposed to be on duty for like eight hours or something and he was on duty for 12 and um anyways he and the and the piece of shit fucking mongoloid cop he uh he decides to pull over a convertible Benz being driven by like a 50 year old man so he gets right on the fucking guy's ass fucking tailgates him and then fucking puts on his siren whoop whoop and the guy the 50 year old man who's like recently widowed like his in other words his wife recently died the love of his life that he you know he is like been married to for like 20 something years or something you know and he's just and he's a computer programmer with diabetes he's like this overweight diabetic guy who just had his wife die cop goes up behind him puts on his siren so the guy the guy pant like he it scares him and he hits his brakes he hears whoop whoop and it's scary he doesn't know what direction it's coming from so he hits his brakes piece of shit cop rear ends him and flies off his scooter his uh, scooter his motorcycle and into the back seat of the guy's car, and there's and 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 and, and some pedestrian snaps a photo of it, and it, it's an absolutely hilarious photo of this Benz stopped with this cop with his arms and legs hanging out of the guy's car, and he looks like a retard. Okay, so yeah, it's all good and fun. But this is the absolutely retarded part. The cop tries to charge the guy with like attempted manslaughter with a with a, a, a you know like a with a lethal weapon lethal weapon being the car he like attempted manslaughter the cop charges the guy with and then this is amazing they go to the guy's house fucking raid his house take his computer and he's a he's a computer programmer so that's his fucking job they take his computer and they go through all the what are you looking at kid I'm kidding I'm kidding uh take his computer and uh, 
search through his computer to see if he has any evidence of anti-police stuff. Like, they would find tons, shit tons of that shit on, on my computer. But they don't find anything. They don't find any uh, blog comments that he's made. They don't find any, nothing anti-police at all. <laughs> Which is amazing. The guy's a bit of a retard. You know, the diabetic guy's a bit of a loser. And to not be anti-police at any, in any degree... And, uh, yeah, so, th th like, they're trying, to s they're trying to say it was a hate crime, that he, he hates cops, he intentionally did it, manslaughter. It's a fucking, it was, this the, it was the cop's fault, 100%. And, the, and what is he doing? He's fucking bullying a 50-year-old diabetic guy whose we we wife recently passed away. American police, that's them. Ooh, is that Happy New Year? <laughs> <laughs>